It's a huge, huge match with huge implications. The first half coming up. Next. Very hard fought loss in the UEFA Cup final to win over our. Looking on, Iniesta. Della Pena had a strange sort of career, been brilliant in. Xavi acquires it, Iniesta, Eto. Good player, good football, this. Messi. Messi. In, but he called them both ways. It's good to see. Good turn by Lionel. Oh, barreling down the stretch now. One game left after this one for Barcelona. But they've got the win. And this man is going to be their leader. It's a beautiful Great pass ball. by Messi. Yep. Good touch by Gio. Who is going to inspire this man's team here tonight without Ronnie? Here oh. you go. Furious touches by Messi. Matago. Ah, defender. Just played for Spain against uh, Georgia, just 21 years old. Yeah, uh, he's going to be a cracker, that guy. Look out. Look out. Some space here. Firing. Kameni blocks that one away. And Xavi this time lifts off it and asks the question of Kameni. Blocking that pass. Leon again, advantage given. Ah. Wrong way that time by Good Jonsson. You see the dynamic play of Lionel Messi again, the speed. Dangerously bouncing around. How quick he gets to the ball, he controls it. And he has up. Good ball. Just short. Eyes in! Taken away. Look Messi out. fires and just misses wide. And he just missed Good Janssen as well. Good Janssen just a little bit late there. Nice lead pal by Iniesta. It falls for Messi. He squirrels in and he beats Hark here. But the last effort just arrows it past Kamini, who again had the angle beautifully covered. Take a look again. The goalkeeper has got that near post. He forces Lionel to go to the back. Dangerous Messi here, Lindsay, again. Big games like this require big men to step up with the big talent, and Messi is showing it in spades here. Messi oh. leaves it. A lovely setup, this. It doesn't fall altogether well at home. Barcelona has been wonderful. Been on the road where they've let the guard down much of the time. Beautiful touch that time by Iniesta to bring it down. Messi. Oh, we played. He's got the motor running. Look out, Lionel Messi. So close. And that burst of acceleration again by Lionel. Fabulous to watch. Look out, Tamudo. Chica defending Messi. We're trying to. <laughs> With some help from Riera. In the reverse fixture last year, remember? Espanyol beat. Great ball. Messi. He'll take him on. 1v1 against Chica. And he does. Look out! Messi still waiting, shooting, and it's a good save by Kameni. He fired it hard. Beautiful setup by the Argentine, Lionel brings it in brilliantly with his first touch and then he's off to the races, has about 25 touches on that ball before he dispatches the hit. Just wants to set it up, keeps teasing the ball, teasing it and then lifts off it. Again, beautifully dealt with by Kamini, soft, soft hands. Minute 33, Tumuto with the goal. Little touch against the near right. Things he did slip. He catches it on his face on the way down. Messi goes for a roll. De La Pena. Well, maybe some contact from behind there. Certainly gets his ankles clipped here, Messi. And that is very naughty by De La Pena taking it down. And as I said, De La Pena taking one for the team here, putting himself on thin ice. He said, I'm sorry. Son, I know it was wrong, but it was called for. 
Messi understands. Minute 32 in the match at La Roma Reda. Yeah, one of these wonderful occasions. If the drama isn't intense and white hot enough, you're listening to the radio of the other game going on at Zaragoza. Messi. Zambrata fighting off. Riera doing well. Messi. Touch. Beautiful. Eto. Again. Down goes Messi again. Play continues. Gosa took the lead on Real Madrid. And again, Real technically leading in the race in the penultimate round because of head to head competition against the defending champions. Deco. Another beautiful touch from Messi. Poke pass. Zambrotta. Consistent threatening football by Barcelona though. Here he comes again. Messi draws attention. Zambrotta. Messi pokes it through. Deco. Oh. So well done by Messi Superb. there. Superb, and a good ball back to Eto. Turns on the Jets, but Gio got around that nicely. Look out, this is Messi. Eto holds well, played across to Flecken and in. And it's Messi finishing it. He starts it and finishes it. He pushes this ball in to Samuel Eto. And the boys in the blue and white shirts are absolutely going out of their schools because they saw the handball that Lionel Messi cheated on in this goal. It has to be said, Maradona-esque punch. Kun Aguero did something similar, you remember, early on in the season, and they are at Santiago's throat here. And you see Rafetti trying to help keep his teammates away from the referee and the linesman. Well, Messi's nowhere near to be seen because he has a face as red as his shirt here. Lionel, Lionel absolutely handles this. There's the ball fed across. Deco it takes a wicked deflection. There's the reach in with the hand. There's no question. There is absolutely not. It happened quickly. It happened fast, as it always does, Ray. But Every, it's disappointing, really. It is disappointing. The astonishing thing about it is how many of the shirts in blue and white saw it. And I tell you what, the Blower Grana shirt see it as well. Look at it. That, you can't get any clearer than that. Even in live play, Lindsay, it looked as if Lionel was certainly reaching out with his hand. It wasn't quite as good as Diego's handball, but it had the same effect. It cheated and it succeeded. It doesn't matter to Barcelona fans who are watching in their thousands around the country, man. It's spilled over. They cannot believe it. The saying, when you see this in replay, Senor Santiago, you will be embarrassed. He says, mm -hmm. Well, for Messi, that is his 11th goal of the season. And I tell you what, in this town of Barcelona, Lionel Messi will not be buying, getting any drink sport for him by Espanol fans, that's for sure. Because they saw the Argentine being a cheeky little monkey with that left hand. It was a good job, though. I've got to give him credit. Wrong sport. Yep. Well, millions of Barcelona fans delirious now. They're back in this game. It's 1-1. One, one. Yep, they were hammering the doors, we said. And it was answered. And it was undone, the lock, by... The thieving hand of Lionel. They called him the Artful Dodger. That's what he's living up to. Right out of Charles Dickens stuff. The Artful Dodger, Lionel Messi. A little cheating basket. Well, he was at the start of everything, wasn't he? And he still is. Brilliant! Just blocked that time. He is so on Messi. Eto, well, the goal he scored against Hatafi, of course, people will be talking. Xavi. Messi. Cuts it again. Dangerous shot, deflecting. 
the type of player that you can certainly build your team around, isn't he? Well, you know he's going to cut to his left, and you still can't stop him. Oh, that's it. And if you do bite too quickly, he can turn it round and bring yeah. it straight back to his other foot. It's that low centre of gravity and, you know, those bug-eye vision that he's got. You know, there's such a combination of... Coming forward again. <laughs> Messi, marked by Chica. Chica doing incredibly well, showing him all the respect in the world. Ooh, close again. Go back to the goal of Messi, Lindsay. Right. It looks so obvious in replay. I thought in lifetime, in all honesty, that it looked a little unusual when Lionel reached in the way he did, and, and certainly his arm seemed not just extended a little bit like the Diego Maradona classic, where Diego really it was basically a reach out of his wrist. As and much a fist, as was it not? Yeah, but but with Messi, it seems to be an extension full of the arm. It, you would have thought the light the referee could have seen, but never mind. Well, he is just 19 years old, Lionel Messi. It remains to be seen what that uh, goal will do to his reputation, if it will enhance it or damage it. For oh, that fearful cross. Here he comes. Plenty of room. Ooh, helps it on. Ah! Oh. Looking behind and threatening. Lionel. Oh, that's a great ball. The hands went up. Was the flag up as well? I'm not sure if the flag does get sent up here. There's again a masterful bit of football by Messi. Out wide. Good Johnson keeps himself onside. Just cannot extend his neck to get the contact with his forehead. Ooh, I think he was going for a handball again. The last weekend of play in La Liga. Ooh, well played. Spinning well. He's, He's in on. alone. Can he finish? Yes, he can. And it's 2-1 Barcelona. No hand this time. It's all with the feet. And look at Laporta. Barca with the lead. Very fitting that it's Lionel Messi. He has been the true antagonist. And again, it's nice approach player. They've been threatening with good constructive, questioning football. Always difficult to deal with, but this kid, the way he's playing, his game is frothing over. It's a nice lead ball in here. It's a nice dish off by Good Johnson. It's a brilliant turn by Deco, sets up Lionel. And cool as Christmas, the dispatch is sent past Kamini, who's got no chance. And remember, as we tell you what's happening in these three games, it's Zaragoza with a lead over Real Madrid early in the second half. Well... Just like Diego Maradona after he had scored his handball goal. Diego went down to score one of the most memorable goals of all time. Probably the greatest goal that was ever scored. And Messi here isn't quite as spectacular. But again, he demonstrates the good side of his game here. It's brilliant by Deco. Brilliant turn to set up Lionel. But again, that wonderful streaking run into the box and that heavenly guided... Last slingshot hit to take the ball past him and he showed everything that is good about Lionel Messi and it deserves to be lauded. Well, fair to say that the best screenwriter, scriptwriter in Hollywood could never come up with a scenario any better than this one for the last two weekends in oh, La Liga. Brilliant! Xavi shooting, minute 15.
on the break. Oh, Turam and Puyal still need to keep their guard well and truly up. But remember, this Barcelona side with three across them. And once again, plenty of room. Messi drops back. Deco, Eto, looking. The drama down in Zaragoza still bubbling on the boil. What a game this kid has had. Beautiful work again by Messi, this time coming back defensively, acquiring the ball. Victor Valdez, no problem. His fortune turning just a little bit in this race for the championship. It's Bar. And a reminder again, our Spanish League highlight show is in La Liga. Stay tuned. And as we've been saying, keep your seat belts fastened. Here comes Messi on the run. Breaks nicely for Samuel, steadies it. Good player. He's up Beautiful. again. To. But again, Barca putting on the pressure. Led by that man. Whatever you want to say about the first goal that he scored, he has had a magnificent match. He really has. Iniesta. Of course, we're proud to bring you inning. Deco. Messi. Otto, the provider. And uh, this is Iniesta. Clever ball. Xavi. Oh, nicely. Oh, oh Messi. He goes down. Ooh. There's no whistle. No, that's a surprise. But against Messi, Santiago is not going to give another penalty. Not after he saw the video replays in the locker room at half time in his referee's room. He'll have remembered that one, but this was a foul against Lionel who goes on the give and go and gets just barged off the ball, I believe. See, that's what you get. Beware the little boy who cries wolf. Talking of wolves, he's reaching in again. Tough oh. challenge from behind that time. Now, a little bit of peer back here. Here's the give and go. He plays it and he goes for the return, look. We are closing. The presidents to watch. The players just going about the business of trying to win a football match. But across in the other cities, there's all sorts of hubble bubble toil and trouble going on. But Lionel's team right now is at top of the mountain. The Porter sweating bullets. God, rarely have we seen him. Beautifully done, Iniesta, Otto. Pullbacks on for Lionel, it's too late now. Stubborn defending by Espanyol, look out. Beautiful sweep by Iniesta, plays oh, it back nicely. Gotta be! Blocked it's... once. Oh, what a big fish just got let off the hoop there. And Double Messi teaming. It's just, it's, I mean, you know how much I love Lionel Messi, Lindsay, but he is just hogging all of the talent out of this team. <laughs> In the area. But it, Messi, this kid, I just not hitting the quicksand at all. He's getting better as the game goes on. They know they are so close. Very little there, Kemeny. 
but Lionel just couldn't get that extra yard that would have dictated for Eto to pass the ball to get that little bit of breather and that insurance. Beautifully done again by Messi. Starts it, gets it back. A few seconds more off. The they were living dangerously when they beat Levante 1 0. They couldn't pad it. Garcia taken down by Messi. How much energy into this game? Tanks. Only got a few more drops left in it now. How much extra time? Two minutes? Three minutes? How much do they have to kill off Barca? Played, but Tamuro don't care. Messi and the word from La Romareda, Van Nisselrooy scored in the 89th minute. So that game level at two, Real Madrid coming back in that match. Tamudo's pace again, too slippy for Barcelona. We'll go back and look at it again. Tamudo. And Espanyol comes back and pulls out a point in the Catalan derby. 2-2 is the final. You see Puyol's frustration. Pure the misery for Barcelona. And this is a man.